back to Summer in the City, day four. Made myself a cup of coffee, and we are headed to Heaven's Hot Bagel. Saturday morning bagels with Ryan, it's the best. And then we're headed to Jersey Shore. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I'm back now. I haven't eaten my bagel yet. I'm saving it for my commute to Jersey Shore. Putting on my glow screen super group. This stuff is just killing the game for me right now. So if you guys haven't watched my last few vlogs of Summer in the City, what are you doing? It's okay. If you haven't, um, I'm vlogging every day and doing funny things in the city. Today's isn't in the city and I'm sorry, but this has been planned and this has to happen and I think it'll be fun footage. One of my best friends, Daly from college today, or yesterday was her birthday and um, she's doing like a whole weekend at her house. Also one of our friends, Melissa, her birthday was the other day. So it's kind of just like a joint thing. And then my friend, Amanda, who was Daly's roommate. They were my hallmates, freshman year of college. You guys will recognize them. She'll be there. She came from Philly. So I'm so excited to see them. Um, I've been to Daly's house once before, a couple summers ago, and it was so much fun. They have a pool. I think we're doing like pool beach day. And then we're going to this place called Parker House tonight, which apparently is so nuts and so fun. It's like a house in a neighborhood and it closes at 10 p.m., which the grandma in me loves. Um, and so you like go kind of like during the day or like early evening. And it's like a big frat house apparently. It's really fun. It's like cash only. I've never been, but like every person I've told I'm going to this is like, oh my gosh, I love Parker House. I'm like, oh, fabulous. I made a good decision. We're making good decisions. Bring my makeup, my little stony clover bag. Also, I'm just gonna be vlogging on my phone all day today because it's just gonna be switching back and forth and I would rather just keep it all in one camera. Using my stony clover duffel bag, it matches this. It's literally the cutest situation right here. Um, I've got my Javianas in there, bathing suits, a little tote bag for the beach, um, and like my outfits for later. I really don't know what to wear. I was like, what do people wear when they go out in Jersey? I was told, <laughs> I saw Eli uh, Rallo last night at GovBall and she was like, dress for the Hamptons, like, but three times down from that in like a dirty bathing suit. I was like, okay. <laughs> so yeah, and then we've got Daly's gift here. We got her a Dagny Dover, like, um, like, fanny pack basically but like you wear over your chest kind of vibe for hot girl walks and then i'm bringing my tote bag i've got my supplements brought some cantaloupe as a side oh i need to bring these earrings for later Lacroix. all right and my computer bringing a lot for one night but you know <laughs> this is my outfit outdoor voices exercise dress i love this so much with all my heart and then i'm wearing these all saint sneakers Let's head to the Jersey Shore. Okay, we made it to Daly's house. I'm so happy. Everyone's still downstairs. We're about to go to the beach. I just changed this swimsuit. It's from Camilla Kaleo Collection. I'll link it below. It's my favorite. And then I'm just wearing some white linen pants. These are my favorite. They're from Cabana South in Tampa. This is literally what I wore to the pool the other day, but I just love it. This button up is from Zara. Again, just love it. I got this little tote bag. It's gonna be my beach bag today. From the one hotel in South Beach. Brought a claw clip, water. This is what's in my beach bag. My Ray-Bans, Laneige lip balm. What else we got in here? Another lip balm, the Sol de Janeiro lip balm. Two options. <laughs> my wallet. Oh, glow screen, of course. I'm also gonna throw in my Kindle, which they might judge me for, but I'm in a reading kick and reading on the beach is the best feeling ever, so. We're gonna head down to the beach. I am so excited to be by the beach and be with my friends. And some of her friends from like high school are here too. So yeah, oh, of course can't forget my Javianas. Favorite flip flops ever. I'm a flip flops girly. And yeah, here's the fit. Let's go. The woman of the hour. She's very important. <laughs> Doing very important things. <laughs> Daily, it's, do you know I'm vlogging every day for I'll two weeks? Day. Yes, the birthday girl. Welcome, guys. Let's go. <laughs> guys, this is her backyard. It's literally heaven. 
Heaven is a place on earth. They have like a little outdoor shower and hot tub over here. So, oh yeah, the shower's over there. Hot tub. This pool, they just built. Last time I was here, they didn't have it. So gorgeous. So we were clearing the beach. <laughs> I look so bad, oh my God. We're clearing the beach because we heard thunder. It's so sweet that they make you clear the beach at this beach. In Florida, they just so nice. they just let you stay out there and risk your life. Risk it for the best hit. So we're going in for 30 minutes. Oh my gosh, we're crowded in right now. We just saw lightning. We're going home for a little bit. This is so cool, this car, wow. Our little hot driver. Vibes. The vibes have changed. We're now watching Daily Sweet 16 video. <laughs> I'm so excited. Hey to you. Happy birthday to you. Make a wish. We're now by the pool. Daily's packing the cooler. It's layered so if you want a Mickey, you can have a Mickey, you can have a claw, whatever you like. Crack open a cold one. I'm like not ready to drink yet, but this is so nice. The gals are in the pool, I'm about to join. The rain went away. My vibe right now is living life. Basking, the sun's finally out. Alrighty, I'm gonna take an outdoor shower. They've got it all in this house. I love it so much. Cause we all need a shower to get ready for the night. This is so cute. They have products out here and everything. Such a vibe. All right, let's get the water going. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I love it, oh my gosh. That was the best shower of my life. Hearing the birds chirp while showering. Incredible, they have a ton of products right here. Mm, I'm content. All right guys, I'm with Amanda and we're getting ready for Parker House. And I just thought I'd show you guys my recent like summer makeup vibe. Right now I really just wanna do no makeup makeup, but it's like a going out night. I feel like I should put on a little bit more than that. So I just put on the Ella Luz beauty oil. I love this stuff and it literally makes your skin look so glowy with or without makeup. And then to moisturize a little bit more, I added the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. Also great. They're blow drying in there, if that's what you guys can hear. Then I'm gonna use the Rare Beauty Saluminizing Primer. As you can tell, I like to be super glowy. <laughs> so that's what we're doing. I also just realized I'm wearing a white shirt and I'm gonna have to pull it over after I have my makeup, but that's a later problem. And then I've been trying to get better about doing my brows before makeup because the gel like messes up my foundation. So I'm using the Refi Brow Gel. This stuff keeps your, la your uh, brows in place. Okay, then for foundation, I'm like in between shades right now because I'm getting tanner. So I love the Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. I also, in the summer, love using the It Cosmetic CC Cream, but sometimes it gives flashback Mary in photos, so we don't need that today. Um, and then I'm just blending it out. And I just, you know, put it on my face. No, a wing or something. Under eye concealer, right now I've been using the Tarte Shape Tape. Classic. It's just a classic. I recently like got it again and it just works, you know? It just covers those under eye circles. Then I love the Chanel Less Beige Cream Bronzer. It's expensive, but so worth it. It blends so well. And I just use this brush. So the key I found is not putting on powder over your face. 
I first like just do all the creams and then I'll put powder where I need and I think that helps a lot. Smoot, what's your favorite makeup product right now? Bit of a switch up. Oh, a switch up going, she's going well, through. I went to Sephora yesterday and they tried to sell me the Gucci foundation. Oh, I haven't heard about $80. it. $80. Oh my god. <laughs> and it didn't even look good on my skin. Did you buy it? Did you get convinced? Oh my god, no, no. Oh, okay, they, good, they good, good. I had me try it on and I was like, girl, like this looks so bad. And she was like, maybe you just need a different skincare routine. And uh, I, was like, I know, maybe it's the product. I was like, I'm not buying a new. $80 foundation and then getting a whole new skincare routine. If you were to spend a lot of money on foundation, I know it's not $80. I don't know how much it is. This stuff, the Giorgio Armani Luminous Okay, Soak. I've always wanted to try that. It's amazing. I'm using the NARS Light Reflecting Foundation. Do you like it? No. I mean, oh. okay. <laughs> hey, gotta be truthful. I, I do like it, but like, I don't think it really deserves all the hype that it gets. Okay, highlight. These are the two that I switched between. Wait, which it? We've got. Oh my god, do you have the say? Yes, I, the star okay, glow. That's actually, okay, I changed my mind. That's my favorite makeup. Oh, you have it too? Right it's so well, great. You, you, you can like use it under highlighter. your face to look more oh. glowy, or what I do. I'm filming right now. Sorry, Melissa. <laughs> no, 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 no. I just want you to know you're on camera. Um, you can put it on like your cheekbones I, for a highlight. It is the best. It's so good. It's so versatile. I've like mixed it in with my foundation before. I like it better than the Charlotte Tilbury. Yeah, and me too. You do? Yeah, that like spongy like, thing. I it doesn't like work. That's an unpopular opinion. Yeah, I'm gonna use this since we're talking about it. But I also like the Rare Beauty Outshine you Liquid do. Luminizer. Do you it's mix it with the Rare Beauty blush? No, I've never done that. Oh, that's interesting. I saw someone do it. I haven't done it, but the oh. say is my, I'm obsessed with it. Yeah, it's so good. I'll like tap it on the back of my hand. Use and if sponge. you layer it with like a powder. Um, highlight. Highlight over it. I feel like it Genius. looks so good. Yeah, like guys, look, I look like a glazed donut. <laughs> love we donut. love it. Uh, Tart lip palette today. So. Just doing like some of my lids. Sometimes it just kind of get wild with it. Mm -hmm. Me neither. I'm just learning <laughs> along the way. And I'll put. I'm gonna put a little shimmery on my lids, and I'll probably put some brown in the crease because it's like a little nighttime vibe, a little soft brown, smoky. All right. And before I put on my mascara, I'm gonna spray this Charlotte Tilbury setting spray. I don't know if it works, but we use it. I agree with that. <laughs> Who it's knows? Fine. I feel like that with every setting spray, though. I'm really skeptical about a lot of makeup products. Me too, but I continue to of use course. them. So. They have to do something. This is the only mascara, and when I say only, I mean Which it. One? That will, oh. it's not like the best, but it's what the only one it? that doesn't, it's from L'Oreal. It's the only one that won't like transfer to my under eyes. So, cause it has this like primer. I have such trouble with mascara. All right, um, I'm not gonna like fully do my lips because we're about to eat pizza, but I'll just put on this MAC lip gloss for to finish it off for you guys. But I'll probably do something else later. All right, that was my quick little 10 minute going out summer makeup. Hope you guys enjoyed. I just thought I'd beef up the vlog a little bit since it's about to be a lot of drinking. But yeah, now we're gonna do my hair, which is what I'm not looking forward to. Yay. Okay, okay. two options yeah, to wear tonight. We have this, it's like a blue set, or we have a white set, and I don't know what to do. All right, we are all ready. Just Dyson air up to my hair. You guys saw the makeup. Here's the outfit. I'm really, really happy with it. I was told for Parker House, you dress like Hamptons, but like more casual, like beachy preppy. I don't really know, so. This is a set. I will link it below. It's from Revolve. I love it. And then I'm just wearing sneakers. Oh my god, my socks are super high. But I'm just wearing these All Saints sneakers. Okay, that like doesn't look good together, but I'm pretty sure it's just like a frat house vibe. So we're doing sneakers. This is the back. And yeah, and then my bag. I'm gonna use this by far bag. So yeah, it's very nautical, I feel like. Um, again, I don't love the shoes with it, but no one's gonna be looking at my shoes, I hope, so yay. We're gonna go downstairs, we're gonna eat some pizza, drink a little alcohol, and then go to Parker House at 6.30, because apparently it closes at 11.30, not 10.
a little behind the scenes. Freshman year roomies to now. Oh. <laughs> Are those truly ice pops? Can I try one? Wait, <laughs> yeah, that's right. Oh my god. All right, we're getting the review from Smoot first. Is it is it like icy hot or cold? Icy. Can you taste it at all? Love it. I really okay. like it. What do you it think? What do you think? Really Good? Yay! Okay, I just tried the Mango Truly Popsicle. Very good. Very good. Alright, we're taking something called Wally's. It's like a fun transportation music fun bus to the bar. Woo! Oh my gosh, what a time. We love it. Oh my gosh. No! <laughs> Let's go lightning. Ba, 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 ba. Let's go lightning. 30 seconds left in the game. The lightning might win. And then we go to the Stanley Cup finals. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm stressed. I'm stressed. I'm sorry, Olivia, I'm sorry. We've got a New York native and a Tampa native. They pause the clock. Eight seconds. Seven. Oh my god. <laughs> We're Stanley Cup fans! Woo! To call Ryan and shit on him. Because he decided to be a Rangers fan all of a sudden. It was nice doing it. Was it was so nice good doing business with you. I'm sorry. Next year. Next year. Lightning just won. We're going to the Stanley Cup. And now we're all here. It's literally 11 o'clock, not even. And we all left Parker House. It was so, so much fun. I get the hype. I met some of y'all. So thanks for saying hi. But since we started drinking at like 5... We're tired. Putting the suit on and we're night swimming. Oh, lightning! Woo! I'm so happy right now. <laughs> this is fabulous. <laughs>